Hello, I'm Safira Lou and welcome to my channel. Hello guys and welcome to this week's fan art video. You may notice I have rejigged the schedule around a little bit. Um, you're still going to get a, a challenge video. I'm going to try and put one up as soon as I possibly can. I'm going to think of rejigging my schedule a little bit anyway. Uh, long story short, I actually injured my hand uh, while I was in the middle of filming. Nothing to um, over the top. I just basically had a fight with a hot water bottle and a hot water bottle won. That's all you need to know. So instead, I thought I'd post up this Princess Peach fan art that I did. Um, I will list the equipment as always down below. And if you have any suggestions for what fan art you'd like to see in the future, please do let me know. Uh, I actually filmed this uh, last week because I was meant to have a fan art video last week and scheduling wise, I just didn't get around to it. And so I ended up filming this, this is a small bonus video. I did want to actually do another masquerade piece for this month's fan art, but time conflicting schedules just didn't end up doing that in time for that video. So this was going to be a bonus video that I was going to post up, didn't get around to it, but it's a good job I didn't because it meant it could go up today, which means you guys don't miss out on the video and I still have content to share with you. Don't worry, my hand is fine, it is going to get better, it's just a little scalded, a little burnt, and it just, it's not, the functionality isn't great, but it's going to get better, so don't worry about that too much. <laughs> so, Princess Peach. Princess Peach is possibly one of my all-time favourite Mario characters. I am in love with everything to do with her design, her colorization, just everything about her. I always play Princess Peach when I'm playing Super Smash Bros. And this uh, fan art is actually based on the game Super Princess Peach. If you haven't heard about it, it was a DS game that was brought out quite a while ago and I fell in love with it. It's all to do with um, Princess Peach she uses her emotions to fight um, because Mario's gone missing. I just love it and I, I shouldn't, but I just really like it. <laughs> But Princess Peach is one of my all-time favourite Mario characters. I'm actually playing through Super Mario Odyssey on the Switch at the moment and the game is just so delightful that I really kind of want to do a Masquerade Princess Peach and Mario from that game oh, in, with the wedding and tuxedo outfits. I just think it's such a lovely game. I kind of want to play tribute to it. Um, but my next major uh, fan art that I really want to do uh, for masquerade version i think i want to do a christmasy one so if you guys have any suggestions down below let me know i was thinking maybe jack frost um with one of my ships from that film or maybe i don't know hmm, maybe frozen that would be an interesting one i don't know what do you guys think let me know in the comments down below so i'm also thinking as well um I might want to swap up my video schedule a little bit. I was thinking about it earlier this year and it will be something I'd like to implement maybe in the next year. So every month I always do one fan art, one challenge, uh, I do one original art and then I do whatever bonus video I fancy at the end of the month. Um, and then obviously my two minute Tuesdays. So I was thinking of maybe actually upping the video schedule to three videos a week instead of two and have more like tutorial type <clears throat> videos what do you guys think i really love to know your feedback on this just because it's something i i'd like to change up my channel a little bit i feel like my not my work but maybe my content may be getting a little bit stale and a bit too predictable so let me know how you think i could improve my videos and what you would like to see more content of in the future I'm always up for doing original work and fan work and challenges. I think they're just so much fun to do anyway. And I always want to do a challenge video every single month. And I also want to really want to push like show an original work every month. Um, the problem is is sometimes the bigger pieces take longer to do than the smaller pieces, which is I one of the reasons why you haven't really seen much Prince, uh, Princess Peach, <laughs> not Princess Peach, why you haven't really seen many mushroom hunters lately or why you haven't really seen any plant witch lately is just because those pieces take up a big part of my schedule and since I'm working as well as um, I've been doing conventions it's not been practical for me to fit that within the schedule that I've been doing so let me know in the comments down below I really do want to do uh, more videos I'd love to do more digital drawing videos but unfortunately my Mac has just died 
Um, so it isn't really something that I can do, unfortunately. Um, but I do have a backup computer, so if it's something that you guys would like to see, just let me know. I want to have your feedback because in the end, I do this. I do the videos because I enjoy drawing, but at the same time, I do them because I enjoy your feedback. I love hearing what you guys do and what you and what art you put in the uh, stay creative tag that I have on Instagram with stay creative with Sephira Lou is just absolutely phenomenal and the challenges that you guys take on I'm just it's so exciting to see <laughs> as you know I'm in the midst of doing Qvember at the moment so if you do want to check that out on Instagram I do highly recommend that um, I've been having so much fun with Qvember it's been a really nice way to warm up before I've actually been drawing for the day I think I'm one behind at the moment because of my hand incident, but um, other than that, I'm pretty much up to date. So the uh, what I'm using here is a uh, De La Rani Mixed Media Paper, I'm using my Pro Markers, my WH Smith Pencils, I use my White Gel Pen, which is a Pentel uh, pen, as well as my Uniball um, fine liners. If you need a full list of this equipment, I list it down below. I also have links to where I buy my art supplies from as well in the description if you're ever wondering. But as always, you know, just feel free to comment if you've missed anything or if you've misheard me say anything because I know I understand sometimes my pronunciation is not the best. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I do apologise yet again, it's not a challenge video, but I will get one of those up as soon as I physically can because it's already half filmed. I just need to film the other half. <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed this final piece look over. Um, I will be announcing a shop update video soon as well. So hope you like it. Maybe comment, like. If you want to see more content from me, subscribe. But as always, folks, Stay creative.